Hi, I'm Richard Taylor from Digital Forensics. The rising popularity of cryptocurrency speculation comes with increased risks for investors. Complaints of investment fraud and price manipulation in digital currency markets have risen sharply. Today we will be investigating about the new crypto Morris Coin. Longrich Technologies from India recently announced that their token Morris Coin was recently listed in an American crypto exchange. It has raised many questions and raised many eyebrows since it is the first company from India of that nature to get listed in an American exchange. By combining digital forensics with traditional investigative techniques and our experience fighting online crime and investment fraud, we are going to find out the facts and deliver clear results to our audience. So, let us do it. Firstly, let's visit their official website, www.morristoken.com, and find out what is there and their white paper. The website says that Morris Coin is a decentralized cryptocurrency exclusively made for the modern business world and individual traders. It says that these coins could be used to avail services at Flintstop, an e-commerce site, to avail travel perks with token via Fly With Me mobile application and used for smart education packages on Study Mojo. Cryptocurrencies are normally created in Ethereum platform and the company claims that their coin is created on ERC20 platform and let us check out and verify the same on Etherscan. Yes, it is the fact. We can see here that they have created the coin and it shows that they have a total supply of 451,687,500 coins. Etherscan is powered by Ethereum. It is a block explorer and analytics platform for Ethereum, a decentralized smart contracts platform. So the coin is real. Now let us go to the critical part, listing. We need to check two things here, whether the coin is listed and about the exchange which has listed the coin. Let us find it out. Now let us go to CoinMarketCap, which is the world's most recognized and reliable platform to check about the exchange. Let us check about the exchange. It says that PayBitter Exchange is launched in 2018. Two years old exchange. It banks with Bank of America and had all required federal licenses. Now, let us go and check on the exchange. It says that Morris Coin is traded as an MRC on PayBitto exchange. Let us see on the exchange whether the coin is really listed and traded. Yes, it's listed and it's traded on PayBitto. This screen shows MRC. Morris Coins paired with Ethereum and trading on the exchange and here you can see it live. Let us see with what other coins it's paired with. Here it goes with HCX, with USD, and this one with INR. This is something remarkably interesting, that this coin can be traded with Indian rupees. Digital forensics have found that Morris coin is legal, it's listed and legitimate. What we also identified, that the coin is yet to be verified by coin market cap, which usually need a lot of time, and there is only limited information about the promoters. But overall, Morris Coin is legal and listed. Thank you for watching Digital Forensics. Good day.